Welcome to Calcutta Races Monsoon Meeting, 18th day, Tuesday, 15th October 2019, concluding day of the monsoon season race preview. First race will be the Flower Dust Handicap Forces in Class 5, a Norway race to be run over a distance of a mile. Number 1 is Aberella. Aberella's last outing was in race number 103 over 1400 meters. Aberella travelled very wide to the track and finished on third. And the winner of that race was Demonstrate, who went on to win it by four lengths. Number two, we're looking at Beat the Bank. Beat the Bank's last outing was very impressive in race number 42, this monsoon meeting in over 1,400 metres, where Beat the Bank travelled third till it turned foam, gradually gained places on the outside towards the stand side, and went on to win that race by a nose by beating Gramercy Park at the post. Also in the same race, we had number six, Singapore Agata, who finished right at the back end to finish on eighth out of ten runners. Number three will be Cool Conqueror. Cool Conqueror's last outing was over 2,000 meters. This monster meeting in race number 108, where Cool Conqueror was leading uh, till, the, uh, till it turned for home and then gradually faded back and finished on third. And the winner of that race was Avellino, who went on to win that race impressively by four lengths. Number four will be Prince of Heart. Prince of Heart's had three starts this monsoon meeting, finished off the boat in all three starts. Last outing being in race number 62 over 1400 meters, where Prince of Heart finished right at the back end to finish on eight out of ten runners. And the winner of that race was Fabiola. Number five will be Shivai. Shivai's last outing was uh, quite an eye catcher in race number 81 over 1400 meters, where Shivai traveled third till it turned for home and then gradually gained a place and traveled quite wide of the track and uh, finished on second, uh, quite a far away second, six lengths behind the winner. That was Gramercy Park, who went on to win it by uh, six lengths, pillar to post victory for Gramercy Park. Number seven will be Happy Returns. Happy Returns last outing was over 1,200 meters in race number 114, where Happy Returns traveled 10th till it turned firm, gradually gained a few places, and finished on 7th after much efforts. And the winner of that race was Optimum, who was too good, won it by half a length. Number eight will be Murdification. Murdification's last outing was quite impressive in race number 88 over 1200 meters, where Murdification traveled eighth till it turned for home, gradually gained places, and uh, absolutely blew the field away by running away and uh, going on to win that race by a nose, by uh, beating uh, Midnight Magic, who came up with a late dash but couldn't catch on to Murdification. We move on to the second race, which will be the Amber Dew Handicap to be run over a distance of 1,600 meters. Number one, we're looking at Jaws. Arazan out of Springley. Last outing uh, was uh, quite impressive in race number 92 over 1,600 meters, where Jaws uh, traveled second all the way and then uh, came and took over the running and went on to win that race impressively by beating Samaril by two and a three quarter lengths. Can repeat again this time out as Jaws being ridden by Suraj Naredu. Also in the same race, we had number two, Samaril who finished on second. Number three will be Apna Time Aiga. Apna Time Aiga has had uh, five starts this monster meeting. Surely been knocking on the door for a long time. Last outing over 2,000 meters in race number 102, uh, where Apna Time Aiga finished on third after much efforts. Also in the same race, we had number five, Descartes, who finished one behind to finish on fourth. And the eventual winner of that race was too good that day. It was Devotion. Number four, we're looking at Bojangles. Winning legend at a moment of the day. Last outing was uh, 
very impressive in race number 67 over 1800 meters where Bojangles uh, traveled second till it turned for home and then gradually took over the running in the last 250 meters and went on to win that race and a ding dong battle with seven step won it by a short neck was Bojangles. Number six will be Airlift. Airlift's last outing was over 1400 meters, the sponsor meeting in race time 101, where Airlift finished on sixth, and the winner of that race was Aftershock, who went on to win it by a length and a three quarters. Number seven will be the last judgment. Last judgments had one win this monster meeting. Last outing over 2,000 meters was not impressive over uh, in race number 108 when the last judgment finished on sixth after much efforts and the winner of that race was Avellino. Went on to win it by four lengths. We move on to the third race, which will be the zip-off plate. A handicap for Made in Austria, three years old, lonely, rated 1 to 26, to be run over a distance of 1,200 meters. Number four, we're looking at Glenda. Glenda's last outing was over 1,100 meters. Has had three starts this month of meeting. Finished off board in all three starts. In race number 104, finished on seventh as uh, Glendava. Also in the same race, we had number seven, Swan Light, who finished one ahead to finish on sixth. And number eight, Solo March, who finished on fifth. And the winner of that race was Russia Gold. Won that race by half a length. Number six, we're looking at Palmeria, top class out of uh, Polynesia. The one start last outing being in race number 90 over 1100 meters with Palmeria finished on fifth after much efforts. And the winner of that race was Tia Queen, who got that one by a length and a three quarters. Lastly, number nine will be El Mulano. Summit that of offshore Anna uh, just had two starts this monster meeting finished off the boat in both its outings last outing over 1200 meters in race number 64 where El Mulano traveled ninth uh, right at the back end till it turned for home and then gradually gained one place and finished on eighth after much efforts winner of that race was Hukumat who got that one by five lengths. We go on to the fourth race, which will be the Mercury Handicap Force is in class five to be run over a distance of 1100 meters. Number one will be Uncrowned King. Uncrowned King's last outing was over 1200 meters this monster meeting in race number 112, where Uncrowned King traveled right at the back end till it uh, turned for home, almost in uh, second last position out of 12 runners, and gradually gained a lot of places to finish on fourth, an eye-catching fourth by Uncrowned King. Winner of that race was Glorious Leap. Number two will be Buddy Holly. Buddy Holly's last outing was over 1100 meters in uh, race number 105, where Buddy Holly finished on 12th out of 12 runners. Absolutely no show there by Buddy Holly. And the winner of that race was Telvia Pass. Number three will be Dakshesh, Verenar out of Elegante. Last outing, quite an impressive one, but unlucky in race number 70 of 1100 meters, where Dakshesh uh, almost got that race, uh, but lost that race by a long neck to Hurricane Storm, and Dakshesh had to settle for second. Watch out for Dakshesh this time out.
Number four will be Midnight Magic. Midnight Magic's had four starts this monsoon meeting. Last outing over 1,200 meters in race number 114, where Midnight Magic traveled seven till it turned firm, gradually gained uh, uh, places, uh, but uh, quite a late run uh, by Midnight Magic to finish on fourth. Also in the same race, he had number five, that is the sixth seal, who finished right at the back end to finish on tenth. Number six, San Remo, who finished on third after much efforts. And number 11, that is... Uh, Auntie's boy who finished on six, but the eventual winner was optimum. Number seven, really, uh, looking at uh, It's a Mukau. It's a Mukau's last outing was over 1,100 meters in race number 95, where It's a Mukau traveled second till it turned firm and then uh, dropped back one place after much efforts and finished on third. And also in the same race, we had number eight, Knight's Gambit, who finished on sixth, on uh, number 12, Jorel, who finished on fifth. But the eventual winner was Hurricane Storm, who got that one by a long neck. Number nine, we're looking at glorious run. Three starts this monster meeting. Finished off the boat in all three outings. Last outing was uh, practically no show there by glorious run. Finished on 10th out of 12 runners in race number 40 over 1,100 meters. The winner of that race was Dilmange Mo. Number 10, we're looking at Ayana. Ayana has just had one start this monster meeting in race number two over 1,100 meters. Now running after quite a long layoff here is Ayana. And in that race, Ayana finished on seventh after much efforts out of nine runners. And the winner of, the, of, the winner of that race was Shania Spett, who got that by four lengths. We move on to the feature of the day, which will be the Monsoon Cup Force. It's four years old and over to be run over a distance of 2,000 meters. Number one, we're looking at who makes the rules. Surely rules uh, here in the city of Joy, Calcutta. Last outing, just uh, one start this monsoon meeting was in race number 85. Over 1,800 meters, was traveling fifth till it turned foam out of six runners. And then came out with a real rattle on the stand side and went on to win it by three quarters of a length. Also in the same race, we had number three cad man who finished on sixth and number five shivalik shahs who finished on third and breeze of the south finished on second Number two, we are looking at Big Orange. Big Orange has had four starts this monster, meaning having finished second in its first start behind Multitude, has run off the boat in its last three outings. Last one being in race number 100, 100 over 1,400 meters, where Big Orange finished on sixth, and the winner of that race was uh, Shuvesh, who came out with a lightning run to go on to win that race by length and a quarter. Number three, we're looking at Hartnell. I beg your pardon. Number four, we're looking at Hartnell. Hartnell's had two outings this monster meeting, having finished fifth in its first start. Last outing over 1,400 meters in race number 59. Hartnell went on to win that race by a long neck by beating stablemate Admiral Hatsu. Number seven, we're looking at Lord of the Sea. Lord of the Sea's last outing was over 2,000 meters in race number 93, where Lord of the Sea finished on fourth. Also in the same race, we had number eight, Multi Glory, who finished on second after giving a ding-dong battle with the eventual winner of that race, that was Smith & Wesson. We now go on to the sixth race, which will be the Hall of Glory Handicap to be run over a distance of 1,400 meters. Number one, we're looking at Spitfire. Spitfire's last outing in Calcutta was in the Calcutta cold weather season in race number 46 uh, over a mile, which is the Calcutta 2,000 guineas, where Spitfire finished on fifth out of uh, Five runners, and the Winchell winner of that race is Adjudicate, now having changed of ownership with Spitfire, now owned by Manjri Hosbeeder's farm, running here in Calcutta, first time in the monsoon meeting. 
Number two will be Midnight Phantom. Midnight Phantom's last outing was over 2,000 metres in race number 98. Midnight Phantom finished on fourth after much efforts, and the winner of that race was Cold Frontier. Came out with a lightning run on the stand side and went on to win it by two and three quarter lengths. Number three will be Oak Brook. Net whiz out of Oakdale, having uh, had four starts this month, so meaning finished off the boat in all four starts. Last outing was not impressive at all in race number 106 over 1,200 metres, where Oak Brook finished uh, right at the back end to finish on 11th out of 11 runners. Also in the same race, we had number 10, Surf Romance, who finished on uh, 10th, and uh, number 11, Rufus, who finished on 7th. Winner of that race was Aquitania. Number four, we're looking at the KISS, multi-dimensional out of Abronia, having two starts this monster meeting, having won its first start over 1,200 metres in race number five. Last outing was pretty unlucky. Uh, the KISS uh, finished on second hour, length and three quarters behind the winner. That is Kramer in race number 65, which is over 1,200 metres. Number five will be Gold Bond. Gold Bond's last outing was uh, impressive but unlucky in race number 80 over 1400 meters. Gold Bond traveled fifth, uh, eighth, I beg your pardon, till it turned for home and then uh, gradually gained a lot of places down in the center. Came up with a real late dash but uh, couldn't match tries to the winner. That is Ashna. Finished two lengths behind uh, and settled for second was Gold Bond. Now being ridden by Suraj Naredu. Watch out for Gold Bond. Also in the same race, we had number seven, Arakawa, who finished one behind. Behind Gold Bond to finish on third. Number six will be Rule Down Under. Rule Down Under has had uh, five starts this monster meeting, finished off the board in all five starts. Last outing over 1800 meters in race number 86, finished on fourth out of five runners. And the winner of that race was Sniper, a runaway winner that day, won it by nine and a three quarter lengths. Number eight, we're looking at Nelson's Blood. Nelson's Blood's last outing was quite an eye-catcher in race number 107 over 1,200 metres, when Nelson's Blood uh, travelled 50 till it turned for home, gradually gained places towards the inner rail and came up with a late dash and finished on second, two and a quarter lengths behind the winner. That is Coup de Gras at uh, Nelson's Blood. Uh, was a long shot at 12 to 1 last outing. Number nine will be Fantasia. Fantasia having won its uh, second last start in race number 82 or 1400 meters. Last outing in race number 109 fell one shot and uh, finished uh, second. Uh, four lengths behind the winner. That is Big Star in race number 109 over 1400 meters. Number 12, we're looking at the straddle, dancing forever out of San Fernand's uh, Bay. I just had one start this monster meeting, and what a start that was by the straddle in race number 96 over 1,100 meters. Traveled third till it turned for home, gradually gained places down in the center, and absolutely blew the field away by two and a three quarter lengths by beating Tough Enough. Can repeat it again as the straddle, watch out for them. We move on to the seventh and last race, which will be the Sri Priya Handicap to be run over a distance of 1,400 meters. Number one will be Adirit Arazan out of Mehami. Just had three starts this monsoon meeting. Finished uh, second in its first start, fourth in its second. Last outing not impressive. Finished on seventh in uh, race number 107 over 1,200 meters. And the winner of that race is Coup de Gras. Number two, we're looking at Stormfront. Stormfront's last outing was in race number 91, this monster meeting over 1,400 metres, where Stormfront, after much efforts in the final stages, finished on fourth. Also in the same race, we had number six, that is Christiana, who finished two behind to finish on sixth, and the winner of that race was Demonstrate, got it by three quarters of a length. Number three will be Expensive Affair. 
Sedgefield out of belligerent uh, has had five starts this monsoon meeting surely been knocking on the door but been absolutely unlucky is expensive affair we need to wait and watch as what expensive affair has to show us on the last day of the season last outing was in race number 97 over 1600 meters where expensive affair finished on fourth also in the same race we had number five rustler who finished right at the back end to finish on eighth out of eight runners and the winner of that race was skied in Number four will be Leopard Creek. Leopard Creek's last outing was uh, in race number 105, this monster meeting over 1,100 meters, where Leopard Creek uh, traveled eighth uh, till it turned firm, gradually gained few places uh, down in the center of the track and finished on fourth. Also in the same race, we had number seven, that is Coconut, who finished on sixth, and number eight, Monte Casino, who finished on second. Uh, three lengths behind the winner, that is Telvio Pass. Number nine will be Botswana Star. Botswana Star's last outing was over 1,400 meters in race number 110, where Botswana Star finished on eight out of nine runners after much efforts. Winner of that race was Whispering Grass, who absolutely blew the field that day, won it by a length and three quarters and sprung a surprise. Number 10, we're looking at Mrs. Villanelli. Four starts this monster meaning. Last two starts being pretty unlucky is Mrs. Villanelli. Finished second in la its last two starts. Uh, second last start uh, got beat by a long neck to Hurricane Storm. Last outing over 1,200 meters and raced them 114. Uh, got beat by Optimum by half a length. And Mrs. Villanelli is the one that you need to watch out for. Number 11 will be Celerino, one start this monster meeting in race number 112 over 1200 meters. Celerino finished on 9th out of 12 runners after much efforts. Winner of that race was Gloria Sleeps, came up with a late dash down in the center and went on to win it by a length and a quarter. Number 12 uh, will be Porus, rebuttal lot of Anacetas, three starts, a sponsor meeting, finished off the boat in all three starts, Lassan being in race number 94 over 1800 meters, where Porus finished on eight out of eight runners, uh, quite a far away eighth, and the winner of that race was Beatrix. Thank you, ladies and gentlemen, for your time. Hope to see you tomorrow, the concluding day of the monsoon meeting. Till then, take care, and we'll see you back in the Calcutta cold weather season. God bless.